Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Football Daily Weekly. Good to have you with us. I'm joined by Lawrence Hello. and Roman Kemp of Pitch Invasion TV. We're talking top 10 players in the world. Chaps, off we go. Roman, who would you like to throw in there? Um, I think you've got to put in the obvious three. Cristiano mm -hmm. Ronaldo, yep. Ribéry, Messi. Yep, uh, we'll agree there. They're going to be in everyone's top top 10. Yeah. Um, I think another player that deserves to be uh, in the top 10 is Gareth Bale. Right. I, I do think, again, for the influence that he's had on his side, he's gone through a very hard thing. It's a big step going from, from Spurs to yep. Real Madrid. But he's fitted in well. He's, he's fitted in very well, and I think he is only going to get better. Maybe a more controversial one is Yaya Torre. Yaya Torre? I think Yaya Torre deserves to be in there, purely for the influence that he can have on the side. He's been tearing up the Premier League. Yeah, this he, is, he is a tank there. Um, <laughs> and I think, you know, it's very hard to stop him. Uh, Lawrence, who would you like to chuck in the mix? Big Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Well, of course. Of course. Do I, I don't even need to say that, do I? No. He just silently walks in and goes, I'll take my spot. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 <laughs> He's already sat down. He's, yeah. He's karate kicked Messi. Yeah. Yeah. Captain's armband on. What about Luis Suarez, Lawrence? He's good, isn't he? He is fantastic. I think he deserves to be in the top ten. I know everyone talks about the Luis Suarez of old or diving and those kind of things, but I think he's in the top ten. He's in the top ten because of the quality of his play, yeah. which, which you know whether whether you still think he wants to bite someone or you think he wants mm. to dive all the time or whatever yeah. it is. I still think there's enough quality in his play, and he's in a side which isn't the same quality as the likes of Man City, the likes of yeah. uh, Chelsea, etc. And he still sure, sure. looks like an excellent player. A stay with, with top players in the Premier League. What about Ozil? Did you have Ozil in top 10? Um, I personally wouldn't have Mr. Ozil in okay. top 10. Uh, purely from watching him, he is, he is for every, every good thing good that he does, he is one of the laziest players I think I've ever seen. <laughs> really? I, 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 he is one of the laziest okay, players I've ever seen. Okay, that's interesting. He is very, wow. very lazy coming back, especially. Mm. Um, you'll see a lot of the players bickering with him. Uh, however, what he does produce mm. is phenomenal. If you're yeah. going on uh, on stats, then of course you, he would be you know, up there. Uh, anyone else? What about any defenders? Thiago Silva? There's a good back line here, isn't there? There's Thiago mm. Silva. Yes. Philip Lahm. Yeah. Not that we're doing back lines, but okay, if yeah. you want to uh, can. have an ounce of structure. And I will. Um, Dante? Yeah. Dante. Someone off camera shouted that one. Um, uh, any other names you want to chuck in there before we... Hazard. Hazard. Eden, Eden Hazard. Hazard, yeah. Hazard. Really? No. The Sorry, teams have been arguing about this off no. camera. Do you guys watch football? <laughs> Sorry, because that's what we're here to discuss. And I think everyone's fawning over him at the moment. And I think he does some great things. Do you think Eden Hazard could be in the top ten players in the world currently? Currently, yes. No. Roman clearly doesn't oh, think that. A few tricks and you love him, is that it? A few, what, a few <laughs> tricks, a few, a few goals. A few chops. A few... Nah. A few lovely pieces of play, a few stringing things Bro, together. Why not? I, if I was to pick the top ten players, I would also put in the influence that they have on their teammates. Mm. And I don't think Hazard brings much of an influence to his team. Okay. Fair enough. He's technical and he's a great player to watch. Mm. There's a different, there's a massive difference between a player to watch mm -hmm. and who is the best. Mm -hmm. And I think someone that is the best, you know, you can look at players uh, like Yaya Torre who mm. aren't necessarily great. To, to watch at points, mm -hmm. but the influence that he has on his team and uh, his ability in defence and attack mm -hmm. is phenomenal. <laughs> and I just think Hazard's a player that is easy on the eye, mm. and I can understand your choice. Mm -hmm. I personally don't agree with it. Three names to finish. Yeah, Iron Robin. I feel like that's a fair shout. Yeah, no, he, he, you know, he, he's part of the what is the best team in the world mm. right now. He's a very influential part of it. I think he does deserve to be up there, yeah. definitely. But Neymar? Yeah. Doesn't get in my top ten. No. Like you said, he's pushing for it. He's pushing for Lawrence? it. Lawrence? Neymar? Just outside the top ten, maybe? Okay, yeah. Sergio Aguero. Oh, injury makes it tricky to say. Yeah. But yeah, surely. I mean, he, he's excellent for Man City when he plays for that side. Mm. He's excellent, so much yeah. of the play goes through it. I, I, I think if you're going on players that... that score goals for your team uh, and do influence then yeah I do think you have to have him in there however I just think there there are better players than him he is in okay. a very good side sure <clears throat> Danny Welbeck yeah that's yeah. what I'm saying still pushing that one yeah, no, we're going to finish that. we're going to finish on that point um, ladies and gentlemen we could sit here and talk about this all day long I'm sure um, uh, do uh, get in touch and let us know your uh, top 10 players in the comments below a big thanks to Lawrence and, and thank you very much to, to Roman Kemp of um, Pitch Invasion TV it's been a pleasure gentlemen and uh, we'll see you next week <laughs>